The episode opens with a 15-year-old woman who has gray hair and a ponytail, brown skin wearing a black blue tracksuit and shoes exercising. A cell phone rings in the living room. There is a couch, weights, a ladder, etc. The woman grabs the cell phone. The woman on the phone. Hello? A voice. Mom, what are you doing? The woman exercising. The voice. Get ready for the 20 meter dash again. The woman. Duck qua. You should know that I'm always racing. Duck qua on the phone. Mom, you have to slow down. You are getting old for this. Dakwa, a 34-year-old woman who has curly black hair, brown skin, wearing a black shirt, blue jeans, and black shoes, typing on her computer with her phone in her ear. The woman, nonsense, I am fine and healthier than ever. As my doctor has said, you are impressive for your age. Keep it up. And I sent you the doctor notes and documents, so why don't you believe me? The woman's name is Gretty. Dequois, I know I am just a worry wart, and I want to act like a regular woman that is your age, relaxing and vacationing. Gretty, Dequois, you know I could never take a break. It's not me, but I am going to visit you. Dequois, me and the children can't wait. They love when you visit. Gretty. I'm glad that you are taking care of all those foster children. No one knows those kids have been through enough. At least they have somebody taking care of them. Dequa on the phone. Too true. Right now they are playing baseball outside with Dax. Dax and 33-year-old man who has brown hair, brown skin, wearing a red shirt, blue jeans, and red shoes wearing a baseball mitt. There is a bunch of kids, some are holding a bat, some have the mitt, and some is by the safe zone. Gritty on the phone. How fun. I tried baseball. It was entertaining, and I had with my old buddies. Dequa on the phone. Speaking of old buddies, how's Gretel? Gritty on the phone. She is fine, just on bed rest. She gave me and the children a scare. Dequa on the phone. That is good to hear, so Dex is waving at Dequa. Dequa on the phone. Well, I have to. Well, I gotta go. Gertie on the phone. Before you go, let me say hi to the children. Dequa on the phone. Okay. Dequa takes her cell phone outside and puts it on the speaker. Dequa to the kids. Grandma's on the phone. Your kid's grandma runs to the phone. Hi, grandma. And Greta on the phone. Is that my beautiful grandchildren? The kids, yeah. And Gritty on the phone laughs. Guess what? Grandma is visiting next week. The kids, yeah, running with smiles. And Gritty on the phone. So you better be on your best behavior. And the kids smiling. We will. Gritty on the phone. Good. Now you go have some fun. And love you. The kids love you too. Runs off. The kids continue playing baseball. Gritty on the phone. Son in law, Dex. Hey, getting ready for the 20 meter dash? Gritty on the phone. Son in law, you know me so well. You better be getting your daily dose of exercise as well. Dex, I am. You will get to see when you visit. Gritty on the phone. Then you better get ready for arm wrestling again. You better not lose easily. Dex looks determined. I am ready. Gritty on the phone. Good. And thanks for taking care of my daughter. Dequa blushes. Mom. Gritty on the phone. I'm just giving him my thanks. Well, I better go. I have a race to get through. Jaqua, well, bye, Mom. Love you. Dex, bye, Mom. Love. I hope I said Mom and Law right. Blech. Love you. The kids, bye, Grandma. 
and pretty on the phone with you all too. And so the screen shows Gertie putting her phone in her pocket and holding her purse. Then gets out her keys and opens the door. Gertie locks the door and pulls the door up. Gertie heads to her car, unlocks it by pressing a red button and opens the front door, puts the purse in the passenger seat and closes the front door.